este aquí. All right. Well, I believe it's a little after one, right? And so we should get going as Lisa. Ah, oh. hey everybody. Welcome to the 2020 manifestation of the Hyde Park Jazz Festival. Look at these friends coming, how nice. I wanted to bring my dog. Okay, more water, thank you, thank you. My name is Maggie Brown. And I am really, really honored, proud, thankful to have been a part of the Hyde Park Jazz Festival every year. Is this the 13th or the 14th year, I believe? 14th. And that is exceptional because we all know it's not easy to um, keep people together and to pull off such a wonderful festival as this always is every year. And um, just want to give kudos, shouts out to the Hyde Park Jazz Festival crew and team and fundraisers for making this happen anyway. How many were fortunate enough to catch some of the streaming concerts yesterday? Oh yes, so did I. You saw Miguel and Dee and all kind of wonderful people. And so we get to do a pop-up. Thanks for being a part of the pop-up, y'all, making us all pop up here. <laughs> out to you of C. Okay. Don't go that close. Yes. Well, what a time we're living in, huh? You lived to see it. As did I. And I know we've been feeling like some caged birds, you know? This first song it's called Caged Bird, and it's by the great Abby Lincoln. Yes. 
I just got to tell you a little history. So Abby was dear friends with Maya Angelou. You know, back in the day when Maya was dancing and singing and my father, Oscar Brown Jr., he would go to singers and artists and ask them, you know, if he could write a tune for them to start getting his songs out, right? And so he knew Maya Angelou and she was in New York at this hotel and he came to her room to sing some of his new songs to her. And she said, wait, 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 I can't be that selfish. I, I gotta call my friend, Abby Lincoln's in the same hotel, have her come down to the room and listen to these songs as well. Well, I don't know if y'all saw Abby back in the day, but dad fell in love immediately. And he asked her if there's a song he could write for her. And she said, yeah, write me a song about a strong man. And daddy promptly went home and wrote this song called Strong Man that, that Abby recorded. Yep, and it was for Max Roach back in those days. Fast forward. That friendship that they kindled then in, uh, let's see, if you were born in 1998, it was 1998 February, dad and I appeared in New York and Abby was in the audience. And uh, she saw me perform with my father and long story short, Abby then invited me to record a couple of duets on her Holy Earth CD. And this is one of them. Everybody's heard that poem, I Know Why the Caged Bird Sings, right? So Abby was inspired by her dear friend, Maya, when she wrote this. Abby said when she invited me, she told me I was gonna have to come to the studio in New York. She said, okay, and we're gonna be doing some bird calls. I said, oh, can I do bird calls? But it wasn't too cold and the window was open in the other room and one morning I was laying in the bed and I heard So then I went on in New York, I was ready. <laughs> They sit with ruffled feathers on the tiny swings and speculate the bird sea and while away the day tug their hair.
Thank you very much. Hey, Lorraine, welcome. So this next tune is a um. It's an original, it's rather autobiographical, if you will. Um, Dad, Oscar Brown Jr. wrote a lot of you know, tunes. Like I said, he would, he would go around, he went up to the Adderleys, we're right up there at the Sutherland one evening. And after they played work song on the bandstand, he asked him what had inspired it, and that's what made him uh, write the work song lyric. And he wrote song uh, lyrics to all blues, and Bobby Timmons' That Dare, and Mongo Santa Maria's Afro Blue. All of these have become somewhat vocal jazz standards. And so uh, ever since I was a little girl, I used to watch Dad on the stage and knew that I wanted to be able to do that same sort of thing. And one day I got the inspiration and it came to me that I'm the Afro Blue and the Dad there too. I'm my daddy's little maggot, I'm here for you to sing my song and to pay my dues all the while I'm chasing away these blues. I know I've been feeling some blues over these last six months, but um, Thank goodness for the music. Call on it, and it helps lift you. Mm. Uh, uh, uh. Boom. Uh. So when I was younger, um, I would try to get gigs, right? I'd send out my package, and I'd send a fictitious name as the contact, right? So as the gold star sardine bar, I was like, you need to try to get a gig there, right? And I sent my package. And the man called back, yes, he's trying to reach uh, Beth Blakey. That's me. He said, yeah, well, we got that package, but uh, eh, she's a warbler. She's not for here. And I was upset. Then I looked up, what is a warbler? <laughs> For me, fixing a show is like a gumbo. You gotta start with some savory stock. Don't need no little pot, pull out the jumbo. Shine up your ring, give it everything you got. Don't matter if the gig's poorly attended or the raft is overflowing full of folk. Whatever heart is in my art, I'm gonna spend it. My aim do a tune and make your throat get choked. Nah. When it's time for me to come before you Grab your time and your attention if I may Best believe I need respect from you that is due Cause when I'm singing it's my heart I give away See first I've gotta contemplate the set list And while all of this is running through my mind I imagine being happy as I could wish When y'all show me you enjoyed what I designed That some of y'all says from my daddy 
others know my brother Bo gets a salute. Brother Phil, Miss McGlynn, Auntie Abby, all trees fertilizing this fruit. Now if I'm giving credit to the is due to a woman though she never took the stage Her impressions and life lessons are shining through Although my mama left here at an early age I've got a host of ancestors go on my list For me to name them all would take some time Every compliment I'm paid I can tell you this I must acknowledge them, else it'd be a crime. Now, some of y'all will say it's from my daddy. Others know my brother Bo gets a salute. Brother Phil, Miss McLean, Auntie Abby. All trees fertilizing this fruit. See, I'm the Afro blue and the dad there too. My daddy's little maggot, I'm here for you. To sing my song and to pay my dues. All the while I'm chasing the way these blues. A youth. I couldn't understand, just thought he was a hater. Never knowing what he told me was the truth. You see, a warbler is a bird that can sing well. What he paid me really was a compliment. So now, everywhere I go, people can't tell. I'm so thankful for the gift that's heaven sent. Now, some of y'all are saying it's from my daddy. Others know my brother Bo is a salute. Brother Phil, Miss McLean, and Auntie Abby. All trees fertilizing this fruit. I'm here for you to sing my song and to pay my dues. All the while I'm chasing away these blues. I'm the Afro blue and the dad there too. Daddy's little bag and I'm here for you to sing my song and to pay my dues. All the while I'm chasing away, chase away, chase away, chase away, chase away, chase away, chasing away. song um that would be uh Thad Jones music and um another brother from another mother the late Calvin Brunson 
who we affectionately call Coco. Woo woo! Yep, he was a musical uh, collaborator with Dad through the years, best buddy of uh, my brother, my late brother Oscar III. And so uh, Coco used to always sing this song. I said, man, you gotta put that in my key. And give me a chart for that one. It's called Kids Are Pretty People. Dad Jones music and Coco Brunson's words. How many people got children out here? Nieces, nephews, someone you touch. Yeah. Touch them. Share what you love. This is one of my favorites. I look back on the set list, I wonder if there's ever a year that I didn't do this song. Huh? Me can't help it. I got three sons, y'all. I've come to learn that kids are pretty people. Little, but still they're people. And like grown-ups, they have wants and needs. And that's where we come in. If people could smile just like the kids do let go and enjoy life don't let anything really get you down that's what children seem to do so what if they grow up and aren't like the people we think they ought to be then May we show we still love them If people could smile just like the kids do Plant love and watch it grow up And hug them and hold them And teach them to keep them from doing wrong
TikTok. I've come to learn that kids are pretty people. Little, but still they're people. Like grown ups, they have wants and needs. And that's where we come in. If people could smile like the kids do. real fast and they'll be out of your household and hopefully when they're out there and it's time to make a choice they're gonna hear your voice if you hug them and you love them and you show them what the things that you love show them the good things so they'll know the difference between the junk and the good stuff out here that's what my grandma used to do she compliment me and then she let me know. She said, I'd be so ashamed if you was out there with the bad girls cussing and stealing and doing all that kind of stuff. And I didn't want to disappoint my mom, my grandma, right? And even though sometimes I'd be out there with the bad girl, I still would hear a voice. And I'd make a choice. I'd hear my grandma's voice. So you got to let them know. Let them know. Tell them you know they can do it. Do you got to hug them and love them and enjoy them before they're grown. one ballad I'm going to do today. Just want to acknowledge the Hyde Park Jazz Festival. Yes. And a lot of times, like I heard somebody last night, they were like, yeah, thanks for the Hyde Park Jazz Society. It's like, oh no, wait, which one? Well, the Hyde Park Jazz Society really is what led to the Hyde Park Jazz Festival. So it's all one family. It's one spirit that wanted to uh, resurrect jazz music to be happening and available in Hyde Park, especially on the south side. And so it started the committee to restore jazz to Hyde Park, and I bet I would not come again another year without acknowledging Dr. James Wagner. It was his vision, it was his tenacity, it was his persistence, relentlessness, that led to the Hyde Park Jazz Society, which led to the Hyde Park Jazz Festival. So I give thanks for that particular ancestor, James Wagner, and um, dedicate this one to a very recent ancestor and loved one. Dedicating this one to Red Singleton Hall. You don't know what love is. Until you've learned the meaning of the blues Until you love the love you had to lose No, you don't know what love is Yeah 
you don't know how lips hurt until you've kissed and had to pay the cost until you flipped your heart and you have lost no you don't know what love heart feels the thought of reminiscing lips lips that taste of tears loves their taste for kissing You don't know how hearts burn for love that cannot live but never dies until you face each dawn with sleepless eyes. Sam and Miguel. Do you know how a lost heart feels? The thought of reminiscing and lips, lips that taste of tears.
coming to the 2020 Hyde Park Jazz Festival. This is the pop-up. Yesterday was uh, the streaming event. And um, we're going to, uh, from here, there's all kinds of spots around Hyde Park. Um, Micah's gonna be playing somewhere else. And yep, there's stuff going on up until about, what, six at least this evening, somewhere in there. So check the schedule. Thanks so much for being here. Another Abbey tune. Not to worry. Never mind. Life will fix it every time. Not to worry, skies are blue, cause everything in is you. Not to worry, never mind. Life will fix it every time. Give a ballad, spill a knee. Bring a flower from a sea. Hold your head up, raise your chin. It wasn't you, it meant it sin. Shake your shoulders, do a dance. Never mind the sad romance. The time has come. A corner turn It's clearer now The lessons learned And time will tell And fires burn Not to worry your head. Think of other things instead. Not to worry, dreams come true, cause everything imagined is you.
turn on keyboards, y'all. There'll be changes after a while. Not to worry, dreams come true. Cause everything imagine is you. Cause everything imagine. Miguel, Micah, Canari, and Samuel. I'm Maggie Brown. Thank you so much for tuning in to the High Park Jazz Fest. There's much more wonderful music throughout the day. Stay tuned. Tell your friends to tune in. It's 10 up. Oh, so really I'm supposed to stop now. Okay, so just give me my little outro music and then we're just going to say bye. Thank you so much. Love you. Really do. Bye.
Little something to leave you with. In the days before Jazz received a college education, when the location of a happening sound would get grapevine around. Y'all tell your friends what a jazz is. All the cats would come clean and descend on the scene to see what could be found. I did jazz. There's something that I'm glad to say. I did jazz. It sounds a call and I obey. I dig jazz. Rip these hip musicians play. I dig jazz. Could listen to them night and day. I dig jazz. And hope and pray is here to stay. I dig jazz. Dig jazz. Yeah, you know I dig it. One little audience participation before we go. Repeat after me. I dig jazz. And something glad I'm glad to say. I dig jazz. It sounds a call and I obey. I dig jazz. Riffs these hip musicians play. I dig jazz. Could listen to them night and day. I dig jazz. And hope and pray is here to stay. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Dig jazz. All right, blessings. Go on to the next spot. Or hang out with us for a while while we pack up. Thanks, you guys.